is obviously not presented by EA Game Changers, but rather exists thanks to Plumbella, who taught me how to screen record The Sims 1 after I desperately asked for help on Reddit. I love you, Jesse. There is a supermodel career. Since I am Nicole Stanwyck, I'm gonna go for stunning because I've been watching too much Juno Birch lately. I know, this is not what I look like in real life, but I just want to be an emo girl. That's what I've always dreamed of. My bio is going to be I don't cook, I don't clean, but damn, I want to become a Hollywood bitch. This is the starter home that I built yesterday for this game for the woman with more dreams than intelligence. That's me starting a YouTube channel right now. And that over there is the mansion that I built for my sim clown house. A pink house for a Hollywood clown bitch. Okay, house tour. The exterior. I'm this stunning. I'm so pretty and so hot. My beautiful living room with the kitchen. Here's my bathroom. I also have this machine so that I can work out. And this is my room here. I have have this mirror to practice my charisma. I have a phallic structure and I also have this easel to paint because you need charisma, uniqueness, nerve and talent if you want to succeed in Studio Town. Okay and since I am a nerd I will follow the tips from the Sims Superstar Prima official guide and level up my charisma, creativity and body skills before I head to Studio Town. And since I don't want you to get bored I'll do this off camera but in the meantime you can check out my dumbass TikTok. I am and want to dye my hair like Abrilla Bean circa 2004. Also, I'm gamer and make very engaging gamer e-girl content. You can find me as Nicole Stanwyck. I'll see you there, bitch. Bye. We represent the stars of today, tomorrow, and yesterday. Looking for at least 15 minutes of fame? Come on, Andy Warhol. Would you like to sign up? I sure would do. Thank you. Now we're heading to Studio Town and I'm so excited. I like her outfit so much. Do you need a ride to Studio Town? Blah, blah, blah. We do. Thank you. Oh my god, this aesthetic is so The Sims 1. Okay, so my screen looks like that because I'm playing the game in a windowed mode. I guess I'll just go here. It's open mic morning today, ladies. I'm gonna step my pussy out and entertain because I am a female entertainer. I am like the Mae West of 2020, but I'm a nobody. Nobody, nobody. I heard that you have to speak to as many people as you can find so that they go to your performance or whatever. Otherwise it flops. Okay, let's pause here. Oh my god. Here is the queen herself, my beautiful skater girl, Avril Lavigne. I have to ask for an autograph. That outfit is so pretty. Oh my god, we look so good together. Like, as girlfriends. Yes, girl. Get that autograph. This is literally performance art. I'm so proud of her. Ooh, I have gained a star level. I'm famous and shit. Well, that was quick. I'm gonna head to the Andy Warhol studio. How about a little taste of Europe? Ew, no, thank you. Is Andy Warhol here? Okay, but I can do a print ad. Okay, so apparently because my game is so bad, I'm not gonna be able to have a photo shoot with Andy Warhol. But I found this woman over here that also does print ads. So she's like the female Andy Warhol though. Well, look at me in a bikini. I love the background. It's like a real life picture. <laughs> we need a spokesperson, not a wooden sign. Thanks, but no thanks. I'm just gonna sit down then. <gasps> Wait, look at how gorgeous her miniature is. Why is my plumba pink? This is our second day here and for some reason I am in my pajamas. On a better note though, I found Andy Warhol. Look how excited I am. I have Andy's validation. I can do everything now. I don't like movies. Wait, let's pause here. This guy, Oliver, is talking to me, like, ask him what is he into, and he's basically saying to me that he likes film. And meanwhile, my sim is thinking that she hates film. And like, I used to be a film director, for those of you that didn't know. Now I hate film also. That's why I love playing with my sim self. Nobody said this would be easy. Well, but it's fucking hard. If you want to know what my house looks like right now, <laughs> I don't think you want to. Oh! Thanks to your agent's publicity machine, the SimCity Confectioners Corporation has issued a commemorative lollipop in the shape of your face. 
This deal earns you 1,000 simoleons, bitch. And now I know exactly what to do with this. I'm gonna go and buy a new bed. Oh, group activity. I wonder what this link could possibly lead me to. This die? What vision, what talent? Nicole received one creativity skill point. Well, that's how I feel anytime I build one of my ugly houses in The Sims. My social levels are, uh... Questionable. I'm not in a good enough mood to work out. Well, if that isn't the biggest quarantine mood, we have arrived. We're gonna go record a jingle because that's what the official superstar Prima guy told me I should do. Hopefully, this bitch can sing. A fun fact about me is that I've always wanted to be a singer. Like when I was a kid, my favorite star was Madonna. She probably still is. I've read countless biographies. I used to run a fun page. I had t shirts, would buy CDs, and I just love her as an entertainer. Sell it, don't tell it. Get my meaning, it ain't your day. Oh, fuck you, bastard. I'm not letting any Robert area tell me how to sing. That sounds so good. Catch a jingle, babe. Why is he calling me babe? Let me fucking put a hand on me, I'ma fucking rip your face off, bitch. You know how the selling point of The Sims is like play with life? Well, this is realistic. So we need two new friends. I have no idea how I'm gonna do that. I'm afraid of my own home. I'm terrified of it. Like, it's so gross. Abril, my girlfriend, I wish I was your girlfriend. No, sorry, that's the best coat song. Oh my god, this outfit is so cool. Oh, <gasps> she's my fan. <gasps> She betrayed me! She noticed that Kenneth is just like way more famous than I am. She was like, bye bitch. Okay, you guys, I just invited Kenneth over, but I'm afraid he will run away if he sees that. Ooh, this tie. For some reason, Kenneth is just not having it. You know that Ariana Grande song that's like, I got a bad idea. Okay, I have the worst idea right now. I'm gonna do something pretty sinful. I think I'm gonna cheat my way up to the top. Ooh, my network is so good. I'm here, I'm queer, and I'm ready to move in. My dream house. It's just so beautiful, so stunning, so show-stopping. House tour. I have this gorgeous backyard. These two, whatever you call them in your language. I'm sorry, why? I just noticed they don't have a ladder. So she's gonna get in. And now I'm just gonna do what all of you bitches used to do when you play The Sims 1. Here we have this stunning, beautiful, incredible. I also have these gorgeous and stunning counters. Also, sorry, not sorry, but I thought this was like the most Hollywood bitch thing you could have in your house. I love the whistles in The Sims 1. I learned how to whistle just from playing The Sims 1. Next, we have my Coca-Cola inspired bathroom. It has this gorgeous sink, which reminds me of a UFO. I also have a Christmas tree in my living room, although there are no seasons in this game, but Christmas is every day. And lastly, but not least, we have this gorgeous... Oh, the color palette was inspired by my own clownery. I'm a Sims YouTuber. I have this gorgeous sculpture that was very, very expensive. If you want to know how expensive it was, let me tell you. <gasps> Hire a female entertainer? Oh, I have buns of steel. My pussy is popping and so... a star on it even though my only star married was being a name dropper thank you for the detail we'll write well that was all for today's video if you watched this till the end consider subscribing please don't forget to give it a thumbs up give me a comment if you want you will be getting weekly videos from me i'm just a girl who loves to play all the sims game quite passionately except for the sims mobile but like we don't talk about her a new video is coming up in three days if you like this one you're definitely gonna like the next one